What is good YouTube and today's focus is on having patience and in this journey having patience is really important to your craft and what you can grow in this life and before we get into that what we're going to talk about is how today's video is going to be unedited because I feel like I've been cutting it up too much and it's not real right it's not how I want my message to be and that's why I'm keeping it unedited and I really just want you guys to understand that having patience in this life is everything right and me going after this goal of this youtube channel and trying to create this motivation and trying to create this inspiration for you guys is not so easy right and it's clearly showing me in this reality that nothing will just come your way right you're not just gonna get it handed to you you're gonna have to work for it you're gonna have to put your energy you're gonna have to put your time you're gonna have to obsess over it and in in true reality you're gonna have to go for it right because at the end of the day if you want something no one else is going to be there for you but yourself so today's video is exactly what i'm talking about is having patience and we're first going to start off the topic of my youtube channel me making these videos over and over and over again i'm telling you guys i didn't always have the mindset of i'm going to make a video every single day and no matter the outcome no matter what it how many views it gets how many likes it gets i'm going to make a video right i never thought this was going to be the outcome i really truly thought when i first started making videos that i was going to get all the views in the world everybody was going to subscribe to me it was going to be that easy and soon i realized that i got the reality check right you're going to make a video maybe no one will even see it no matter how good it is right no one will see it and you're going to have to go on and on of just failing and failing and failing and what it really taught me through this is to understand that nothing is promised right and this really awakens your mind to understand that if nothing's promised then what is there, right? It's what you can do. It's what you're willing to do. And what I've realized in this life is not many people are willing to risk at all. And that risk is what you're going to get, right? It's the reward. You need a risk for the reward. So what, what do you want in your life? What do you want to achieve? What are your goals? And then understand that it's not going to be easy, right? It's not just going to come to you. But that does not mean it's not impossible, right? Because it is possible. That's why people are achieving that. That's why people have these goals and have these dreams and achieve them because they work for it. They put in the time, they put in the energy. And there's so many excuses with that. And I understand that because a lot of people started off earlier. A lot of people had a helping hand or a lot of people just had all the equipment in front of them and they could just press record and they could send it to an editor right away, right? There's a bunch of little quick outs and quick, easy ways to get there. But at the end of the day, it doesn't matter what you have. It's a matter what you think. It's what you feel. It's what you understand, right? There's a certain line of truth in this life, how I see it on what is important to you, right? And the truth is right in front of you, right? There's always ways to go around it of not telling yourself the truth and always hiding from it and lying to yourself because most of the time, the truth is gonna hurt you, right? Because the truth is actually what you put in. The truth is actually what you've done. And many people like to live in this fake reality, this this fake life that they've done everything perfect and they lived their life the best way they possibly could. But most of us and all of us understand that you can't be perfect, right? Everybody's gonna mess up. Everybody's gonna do something that they don't really stick by. It's not by their morals, but they did it because they didn't feel right, right? They didn't know what was right. They didn't know what was wrong because they're lost. And this happens to many people, right? I'm not gonna hold a judgment to someone and make them think that they gotta be perfect because it's impossible, right? No one is just gonna be perfect in this life. So this is when you come to realize and understand that your patients are everything, right? There's so many times that you can just freak out. There's so many times that you could just rage about everything, right? Because it's so easy, it's so normal, it's so natural. But at the end of the day, what is it doing for you, right? What is it creating into your reality? What is it creating in your mind? That's why I want you guys to understand that patience are everything, right? Having patience, understanding that it will come in time. It will happen. And you just got to keep putting in the effort. You got to keep putting in the energy. You got to keep trying. You got to keep getting up even though you fail because that gives you a chance. That gives you an opportunity for it to actually happen. Now, if you don't have patience and you're freaking out about everything and raging about everything, when it, when it happens, what is the cause of that, right? You're not gaining anything from it. That's how you fail. That's how you quit. That's how these people never reach their dreams and live in regret because they react. They don't have patience. Having patience is everything. 
and it, it stems off with this YouTube channel, right? I would never be making this video today if I didn't have patience. I would have quit a long time ago. But it's not just with my YouTube channel. It's with what you're doing in your lives. It's what I'm doing in my life, right? It's what you have patience with, what you will stay consistent with, what you will keep trying even though you keep failing, right? All these people that created these inventions in this world. You're looking at Elon Musk today, day and age, all of us can look at him, right? He's building rocket ships over and over again. It keeps failing over and over again, but he's addicted to his craft. He believes in what he sees, his vision. So he keeps trying. And that's something that we can all see right in front of our eyes, but it's with everybody, right? It's with people with businesses, people with jobs. The person, first person that created a light bulb, right? It took him a thousand attempts. He failed multiple, multiple, multiple times. But on his next attempt, it was a success. And now everybody uses it. And it's a normal thing to our reality and what we see today, right? But how many times did it take for him to actually make that? How many times did he fail? And if he didn't have patience, what would have happened, right? Would that ever be created? So I really want you guys to awaken your minds to understand that anything in this life is possible. It's just whether how you see it. And that's why every single video I'm giving you guys the perspective on how I see it. Because I've understood me growing up and me going through all the things I've went through in my life has really changed my mindset, right? I didn't always think this way. I wasn't always so sure that there's a life out there for me, right? I didn't always believe that my dreams and my goals were possible. I sure had confidence and I was a cocky kid and I would express it all the time, but I never believed it inside. And I think that's what carries you, right? If you truly believe it inside and you truly see it for how it is and you give all the energy you possibly can, you will be rewarded in this life and you will be rewarded how much you put in, right? It's energy, right? It's karma. If any of you guys believe in the karmic cycle or if, it, if you even know what that is, everything reciprocates, right? What energy you're going to put in is the energy you're going to get back. So if you don't really care about it and you just tell yourself, oh, I want it because it seems cool and it looks cool, but you're not willing to actually put in the energy and the time for it, then you're just going to keep dreaming about it and thinking about it. But if you're putting in the time, if you're putting in the energy and you obsess over it and you actually want it and inside, deep inside you, you want it. It's not just for show and just telling people you want it, but you want it. You will see it right in front of you, right? So just keep living your goals, keep living your dreams and never give up on yourself. And if you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure to drop a like on today's video. Comment down below what you guys want me to talk about tomorrow, anything you guys want me to talk about if it's just something that's going on in social media, something that's going on in your life, anything. I'm here to give my perspective on it and make sure you guys subscribe if you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace.